so this first step as siddharth mentioned is you have to create a geometry and you have to parameterize in the cat it simlab can very well connect to creo nx and catia it has a got a bi direction uh, associativity with that second is how do you set up a model in simlab so you create a python script or a json script preferably a python and once that model setup is done the step 3 would be connecting this three in hyper study and driving the design exploration step that would include uh, either a doe setup or a fit or an optimization we had is a multi phases optimization scenario for hydro pump involving structural and cfd domain and the design variables that being incorporated were pump wall thickness uh, rib thickness rib height number of ribs and the spacing of the ribs so in the end of the optimization what we got is we got a pareto front obviously uh, depicting the range of the optimal designs we chose the best three the best three the first one lies somewhere here where it is the best pertaining to goal 2 optimization design 3 is something which is lying uh, somewhere here which is the best of goal 1 but what we have chosen is the optimal design 2 is the best design which is the best of both the objective it's it's saying it it has got a minimization of goal 1 which is a volume and it has got minimization of displacement so it best of all 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 of these are optimal designs but as for the requirement design requirement of having a minimized volume this is where our design lies the best design lies uh, just to give an idea of the doe that we did on this example uh, here that if you look at displacement and volume the top contribution was coming from rib height whereas it was not contributing a lot in terms of volume the rib count the number of ribs if you see in my previous slide the rib the best designs are varying from rib number 2 to rib number 3 and 4 are having a most more importance on the volume the similar thing goes on for the pump wall thickness it's not contributing a lot of it uh, the in the for the displacement although it's 22% but it goes really low for the volume what are the most important parameters here are the rib height the rib count and pump wall thickness so we can ignore these three parameters while doing an optimization so that's how we have reduced the design scope and we can find out much more better answers in less number of iterations in terms of the linear effects now what we see is for displacement all are having a negative effect each of these variables are having a negative effect whereas for volume they have like a mix of both a positive and a negative effect. what we see is pump wall thickness rip height everything is having a negative effect on displacement whereas it's having a positive effect on your volume so these are, this is the information that you get by integrating hyper study with simlab for doing your doe studies and then creating a mathematical model and finally optimizing it